This brief video will provide an overview of the Fleet Movement Data Portal that's been pr produced by the Multi-State Fleet Response Working Group, a national working group owned and operated by the private sector under the All Hazards Consortium, which is a 501c3 supporting states in the Mid-Atlantic and Northeast regions. This data portal was built on requirements from the private sector to help expedite fleet movement across state lines throughout the U.S. This was designed initially by the electric sector, but involvement in nine or ten other sectors, including telecommunications, food, gas and oil, many others have been involved in the development of this. So this portal provides a single place for the private sector to come to get access to state information across the country, which is maintained by the states, in addition to other private sector related information. So this portal is divided in right now into three areas. There are several other areas under development. The first one is emergency resources. This is not available just yet. We're still working through the legal issues regarding this, but this will be a national real-time database of open and closed gas locations and for food and fuel, pharmacies and hotels. This was actually tested during Hurricane Sandy when a spreadsheet was developed of this data through our private sector partners and circulated to the federal government, states, and state and local, as well as the private sector responders. And this gave them data points of where to get gas before they got into the impacted areas that were out of power. So that spreadsheet now will become a service in the next several months. The next one is the fleet data information. This is a national database of fleet-related information for all types of Department of Transportation websites and so forth, covering fuel and trip permits, roadways, way stations, commercial motor vehicle road restrictions, hazmat, all types of information, hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of websites linked into a single place here within this portal. Lastly, there's a section in here on the electronic toll collection systems. So this centralizes all of that into one place so the private sector can come, learn about these systems, their geographic coverage, how to sign up, how to leverage them in case they need to move into those areas if they're from out of the region or if they're within the region, how to use this as from a commercial standpoint. A live demonstration of this will be provided in another video for each of these services. But this is a screenshot of the private sector resource information called the Fleet Open Close Service. This is under development and again should be made available shortly sometime in the next several months. But you can see this screen provides a national map. Over on the right, you set your layers that you want if you want to see food, fuel, hotel, or pharmacy. And then you select whether you want open or closed locations. And what will light up across the country are red and green gas pumps, red and green fuel locations, red meaning closed, green meaning open, red and green hotels, and red and green pharmacies. We are working on future data sets with specific to fleet movement that could include ATM machines, social media, federal information, hospitals, and so forth. This screen shows the fleet movement and toll data. It's been combined into one service. So, for example, at the state of Virginia here, each one of these sections will provide specific detailed information related to fleet movement. So you can see there's State Department of Transportation resources, and some of these have hundreds of uh, pieces of information on dozens of websites. It'll talk to permitting uh, for temporary fuel and trip permits. It talks about roadway conditions, commercial motor vehicle road access, what roads work with what trucks, way station information any specific vehicle information about commercial motor vehicles for that specific state, and of course tolls with regards to each state. Do they have toll roads and bridges? If so, what's the information? What's the service provided? How do we contact each bridge or each tunnel or what have you? It's very robust, and this will be provided in another video. 